what's up YouTube? I'm Cerebral Palsy Gamer 98. Welcome back to the channel. Today I am in Forza Horizon 2 yet again. And if you remember in uh, yesterday's video, we bought the 2014 Corvette Stingray. Now I built this thing up a little bit, and I based it off of Street Speed 717's. Corvette Z06. I was not able to buy the Z06 because unfortunately you have to pay real money for it. <laughs> but um, I'm going to take you through the build in this video. So um, without further ado, let's get into this video. And please don't forget, if you enjoyed, to give it a big thumbs up and hit that big red subscribe button. Here we go. Slowly right now, because honestly, really hard to control. Like I've got the biggest tires on it that you can get, and it is still really hard to control. Sorry about that. Turn around. I'm gonna when drive it is safe you there so. instead of um. Fast traveling, so. In 200 yards, keep right. Keep right. In 400 yards, turn right. How's everyone's day today? You can let me know by posting down in the comments. I hope it's turn both. right. There's another state right there. Who needs the road, huh? Okay, some speed right here. 160, 170, 180. Ooh. You have arrived at your destination. Okay, this thing's fast and I love it. So let's run through the build. Dude, and what's up? I How just I went to the wrong place, didn't I? I went to the outer show instead. Hey, don't be shy. Come on in and let's fix her up. Okay, so here we go. So for the air filter, I obviously upgraded it to the highest. And everything in the engine category, I upgraded to the highest. Um, Stock, this thing came with 455 horsepower. I don't know the torque because I didn't um, look at the specs before I upgraded this. I will put it down in the description below. So 
we got a positive displacement supercharger on there. And a race flywheel. Everything maxed out for the handling. I didn't want to go for the Storm Island handling, so I just went to like the max. And we got our roll cage there. A race transmission. Upgraded differentials. And this is where I said I went to like the max everything for the tires. And even then, if you go max with the tires, it still like it just wants to slide. It's it's fun, honestly, but it's hard to control. And I went with um Speedline tires for this build, as you can see right there. I think that's pretty much it for everything. I went for. Oh, yeah, I went for a Hennessy race ring by the way them things look sick on this car this car just looks so sick i hope street speed 717 sees this video And for the aspiration, we obviously went for the positive displacement supercharger, like I had said before. I don't know what I was doing here. So we have a total of 877 horsepower. I can't read the torque because I'm seeing such a small screen right now, but hopefully you guys can see it when this video uploads. I was trying to see if I could show you guys the previous horsepower numbers before I made this setup, um, but unfortunately it did not show it. So, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. So let's take it for a drive. Take it out 
on the highway and uh, do a few burnouts and stuff like that. But you can already see it's just a monster. Try to do a few burnouts here. I couldn't really get it right. Yeah, that was bad. Ooh, there's a good one right there. There we go. Yeah. Let's try racing somebody and see how it does. I think I'll find somebody on the highway here. Attention to the difficulty rating of festival racers before you challenge them. Higher difficulty well, that's pretty much going to do it for the video. So if you guys enjoyed, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. There's a lot more content where that came from. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. Peace guys.